The British Army has achieved a significant milestone with its first live firing of the Archer 155mm wheeled self-propelled howitzer in real combat conditions. This occurred during Exercise Dynamic Front 2024, a major NATO exercise held at the Rovajarvi training area in Rovaniemi, Finland. The 19th Regiment Royal Artillery led the live-fire demonstration, marking the first tactical use of the Archer in a combat-like environment. This event highlights the UK's commitment to enhancing its artillery capabilities in alignment with NATO's strategic objectives. The Archer self-propelled howitzers are part of a broader modernization effort by the British Army. In 2019, the Ministry of Defence placed an order for 24 Archer units from BAE Systems Haglands, with the first deliveries taking place later that year. After a period of testing and integration, the Archer officially entered service in 2020, replacing older platforms like the AS-90 tracked howitzer. The new system offers superior mobility, firepower, and advanced technology, making it a crucial part of the British Army's artillery modernization plan. By July 2024, the British Army reached a key milestone by accepting all 14 Archer systems into service. This acquisition significantly bolstered the Army's 155mm close support artillery capabilities, particularly following the transfer of 32 AS-90 units to the Ukrainian Armed Forces. The final 10 Archer units were swiftly integrated into the British artillery arsenal, ensuring the UK could maintain robust artillery support while continuing development on future systems like the remote-controlled howitzer. Along with the delivery of the howitzers, the UK benefits from long-term maintenance and technical support, helping to ensure the Archer's sustained operational effectiveness. The integration of the Archer is also supported through ongoing training and participation in multinational exercises such as Dynamic Front, strengthening ties with NATO partners and testing the system's capabilities in realistic scenarios. Exercise Dynamic Front, one of NATO's most important joint artillery exercises, involves over 5,000 soldiers from 28 nations. The UK sent more than 250 personnel, with the 19th Regiment Royal Artillery leading artillery operations. In this exercise, the Archer was used in live-fire scenarios to evaluate its performance under real combat conditions. Additionally, the 5th Regiment Royal Artillery introduced the new Taipan radar system for precision targeting, further enhancing artillery operations effectiveness. The Archer is a cutting-edge artillery system, designed and manufactured by Sweden's Bofors Defense. Equipped with a 155mm L-52 howitzer, the Archer is capable of firing NATO standard 155mm shells, including high-explosive, guided, and extended-range projectiles, providing both offensive and defensive fire support. One of the most notable features of the Archer is its automated loading system, which significantly reduces crew workload and increases operational efficiency. The system can fire up to 8 rounds per minute, with a burst rate of 16 rounds within 2 minutes. This capability enhances the system's effectiveness in rapid suppression and precision strike missions. Mounted on a Volvo A30D all-terrain chassis, the Archer offers exceptional mobility, ensuring that it can quickly relocate on the battlefield. This mobility is crucial for avoiding counter-battery fire and adapting to dynamic combat conditions. Its ability to reposition rapidly while delivering fire support makes it a highly flexible tool for modern warfare. The Archer is equipped with an integrated fire control system that enables rapid target acquisition with minimal crew input. It processes data from forward observers and reconnaissance assets to deliver accurate fire support. Furthermore, the Archer can fire precision-guided munitions, PGMs, such as the bonus anti-tank shell, providing added versatility for targeting armored threats. With a range of up to 30 kilometers for standard rounds and up to 50 kilometers for extended range projectiles, the Archer offers significant standoff capability. This range, combined with its fast firing rate and precision, makes the Archer a formidable asset for artillery units in both conventional and unconventional warfare. The Archer places a strong emphasis on crew safety, featuring an armored cabin that protects personnel from potential threats. The automated loading system reduces human error, improving operational efficiency and minimizing risk. Moreover, the system's versatility extends beyond traditional fire support roles, making it suitable for peacekeeping and humanitarian missions as well. The successful live-fire test of the Archer during Exercise Dynamic Front 2024 demonstrates its readiness for rapid deployment in diverse operational environments. With its combination of automation, mobility, and precision, the Archer significantly improves upon older artillery systems, providing the British Army with a powerful and flexible solution for modern combat.
As the British Army continues to modernize its artillery forces, the Archer self-propelled howitzer will play an integral role in strengthening the UK's defense capabilities and contributing to NATO's collective firepower. This milestone marks an important step in ensuring that the British Army is well-equipped to meet the challenges of future military conflicts, reinforcing its position as a key player in global defense operations. Thank you.